up guys welcome or welcome back to my channel it's your girl shandy here on the channel we talk about manifestation a law of assumption lifestyle spirituality all of those good things that have to do with one another in today's video we're going to be talking about how you can manifest a text message from your specific person manifesting a text message from anyone in general it doesn't have to be just your specific person you can manifest a text message from a friend a family member anyone anyone that you want to manifest a text message from it's very very fucking possible and in this video we're going to talk about how you can go about manifesting a text from whoever you want whenever you want how fast you want to it doesn't matter if you haven't been in contact with this person for two months three months four months five years it doesn't matter if you want to manifest a conversation from this person from this specific person you can do that i promise you it's very easy it's so easy so let's jump right into this video if you've been having trouble manifesting a text message from a specific person or from a person that you've been waiting or wanting to hear from, there's only one reason why you haven't gotten that text message yet and there's only one reason why you're not manifesting that or you're not seeing any movement from this specific person and I'm gonna tell you why. So lean in a little bit closer. You are letting your fears get in the way of manifesting this person's text message. You're letting your negative thoughts get in the way of manifesting this text message, manifesting from hearing from this person. It's you. It's just you. You are to blame for that. And we're going to have to start taking some accountability around here if we want to start manifesting, okay? Hold yourself accountable to the fact that you're not having any movement because you're telling yourself you're not having any movement. Your subconscious is only going to manifest what your thoughts are saying. If you're constantly telling yourself, there's no way this person's gonna text me, I fucked up, I did this, I did that to them, they never wanna speak to me again, blah, 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 fear, doubt, guilt, whatever that is, is keeping you back from getting that text message. It doesn't matter what you've done, it doesn't matter the history, it doesn't matter how you guys left off, if you wanna receive a text message from that person, you most definitely can. If you're having thoughts of, this person, I, I fucked this person over, I did this or I did that, there's no way, then literally there's no way that person is gonna text you. Whatever you're thinking, whatever you're feeling is going to manifest. If you keep telling yourself that this specific person isn't going to text you because of whatever history you have, then it's not gonna happen. Whatever fear or negative doubts that you're bringing up is going to manifest because your most dominant thought manifests, not what you want. It's your most dominant thought. You can want this person to message you, but if your subconscious follows up with the fact that this person never wants to speak to me again, they're never gonna wanna speak to you again stop telling yourself that this person doesn't want to hear from you this person doesn't want to reach out to you you have to start rewriting your script and i think a lot of that starts with self-concept and knowing your worth and knowing yourself i fucked up so many times in the past but that didn't stop me from getting the things that i want and it also didn't stop me from getting back into connections with people that i genuinely care about it's very possible and i'm going to tell you why it's possible i just want to remind everyone out there that we are all connected this is all oneness we're all connected to source we're all connected to divine energy like we're all connected to source energy trees are connected to source animals are connected to source we're connected to source you feel me anything that's living and breathing is connected to source so it doesn't matter if you're five miles away from this person you want to hear from or if you're 500 miles away if you want to hear from this person you can because we're all connected energetically allow yourself to visualize this text message from this person. Visualize this text message from this person. Visualize the conversations that's gonna be had. What are you gonna talk about? What is gonna be the conversation starter? Who's gonna start the conversation? You know, things like that. Start putting yourself into a higher frequency of you know, this person having had already texted you. You have to live in the end, live in the fact that this has already happened, this person has already texted me. If you can see it in your mind, you can visualize it in your mind, it's already real. The 3D world just now has to catch up. I can't count how many times I've done this myself. Like literally, I've manifested conversations with people I probably haven't talked to in a year. And what I do is I just visualize this person texting my phone, I'll visualize the notification bell going off, and I'll just visualize myself smiling or saying something like yo this person really texted me like this person like i really just manifested this i really manifested this person text me i feel like that's a great affirmation too i know that that affirmation helps me a lot when i say things like i can't believe this person really texted me i can't believe it really happened because it puts me in that energy in that space of having it basically it puts me in the energy of this person already texting me it already happened and then from there just let it go sometimes we have the right intentions when it comes to manifesting but once 
it's time to let it go. I feel like that's the hard part. People don't know how to let go. The most simplest way I feel like to let go is to just live your life. Don't think about it anymore. It's already done. If you have something that you want, you are no longer looking for it. You're not turning on your phone every five seconds to see is it here yet, is it here yet? Live your life because you already trust in source in the universe and you already trust in your subconscious to bring this manifestation to you. You already trust that this person is about to text you because that's what you want for no other reason except for the fact that that's what you want. I want this person to reach out to me. So they will because that's just what I assume. I assume that because this is something I want, it's gonna happen. I definitely feel like self-concept is probably one of the most powerful things for people to do when it comes to manifesting you have to know your power you have to know that this is something that you can do it's so fucking easy to manifest a text message is not even funny the only thing that holds you back is the fact that you think that it can't happen for whatever reason nobody knows whatever reason it is but you let me let you know this now it's possible it can happen i've had people text me in like five minutes that i haven't heard from in fucking forever like i said the best way to get your spe your specific person to message you is to visualize it live in the end affirm affirm and persist that they're going to text you they're going to text me they're going to text me they're going to text me. they're going to text me because they realize how much they love me they're going to text me because they realize the bond that we have they're going to text me because they miss me so much you have to believe what you're saying for it to happen you know what i mean stop telling yourself this person is never going to reach out to you you are capable of anyone reaching out to you of anyone speaking to you i guarantee you that if you just affirm persist let it go and live in the end that person is going to text you there's no if ands or buts about it have you ever realized sometimes you just randomly think about someone that you haven't been thinking about at all and they're just randomly on your mind they're probably thinking about you talking about you dream dreaming about you whatever because that's how connected we are all it takes is for one person to constantly or persistently think about something or someone and it's gonna come into fruition into your world it's so easy for you to manifest somebody to text you i promise you you just have to believe that it is you have to believe that that person is gonna reach out with that being said i want you guys to just persist and visualize and live in the end and know that this person is gonna reach out to you if you're watching this video and if you've made it this far this is your sign that this person will reach out to you this person is going to message you and you're gonna make things right you're gonna manifest this person have a conversation everything's gonna be just fine you have to persist that you have to affirm that you have to believe that take some accountability in your life as well because i feel like people don't say that enough if you are taking accountability in your life things will manifest that much faster you cannot manifest in a victim mindset it's just not gonna happen no offense to anyone but a victim is always feeling sorry or feeling bad you know what i'm saying and i mean like in a way of being a victim to your own life stop being a victim to your own life because you're never going to get the things that you want that way and i am going to be that person that's going to be hard on you and i'm going to let you know that that is not how you manifest and that is not how you bring things into your life for feeling bad for yourself and feeling sorry for yourself you have to stand up on your own too and understand the type of person you are understand your power understand how powerful you are understand that it only takes persistent thoughts for you to manifest the things that you want in life you've done it in ways that you didn't want to and now you can do it in ways that you want to you've manifested unconsciously plenty of times in your life before you can consciously manifest and you can take control of the wheel and ride this thing out and manifest your fucking best life because you can you just have to say this is my life i'm stepping i'm stepping into my motherfucking power I'm stepping into my power i'm honing into my power this is what it is this is what it's gonna be that's all there is to it step into your power own your shit you feel me own your shit that's the only way you're gonna manifest the things that you genuinely want to manifest by taking control of the wheel and guiding this ship or this boat or whatever dri driving this car wherever you say is gonna go wherever you say you're gonna manifest you're gonna manifest no more unconscious manifesting i'm gonna wrap this video up here and i hope you guys are able to take something from this today if you need have any more questions or anything you can most definitely leave a comment down below also if you've made it to the end of this video please like comment share and subscribe and get this channel up because i want to keep bringing more manifestation videos to you 
I have had so many things happen and change and transform into my life just by using these laws. And I really want to share it because like I said, I feel like everybody deserves to live their best life. You just need a little bit of push from somebody else, even if it's a stranger over the internet. So I'll see you guys in my next video. Like I said, like, comment, share, and subscribe. Any videos that you would like to see next, any questions, I will answer them for you. Q and A's, whatever. Let's just get this channel up there. Bye.